Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video, we're gonna be on the topic again if HDMI can give you 240 hertz or a higher refresh rate rather than 60 hertz which is the like basic you know for HDMI cable we've proven in the other video that HDMI 2.1 can give but some of y'all don't have the HDMI 2.1 cable you just have the HDMI cable and I tested it in the last video some of you guys says it works some of you guys says blah blah blah, blah, blah. some of you guys still ask me some questions so in today's video I'm gonna try to help y'all so right now I'm gonna type display right and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm using right now before we change it you feel me I'm gonna go down here we're gonna go to the DP you see I'm using the DP it's on huh it's on 140 I was like huh why was it on 120 Hertz ah I changed my setting anyway now I'm on the DP 1.4 this is the main cable that I use my computer or my laptop it has the type c hdmi and uh display port like i can use any of the options but i choose the display port because it's faster and i get more refresh rate while gaming you feel me so it just depends on what you're doing so if you want to know which one is better for you if it's for recording or fps or input delay i made a video on that too link in the description but yeah i'm using a dp 1.4 right now I'm getting 240 hertz as you guys can see from my 144 hertz laptop but I'm gonna change it I'm gonna use the HDMI cable pow and I'm gonna try again hopefully this time it works so I just plug in the HDMI cable and we're gonna test it right now I had to turn my refresh rate back to like uh, 60 frames before the HDMI could work I don't know why but anyway this is DP this is the HDMI. This is not the HDMI 2.1. My HDMI 2.1 cable is over here. This is the HDMI 2.1 cable that I have and it actually does work. That's the 2.1. So the HDMI now, we're on 60 Hertz. We're gonna go to 240. But the problem we had last time was you guys were saying that I didn't press keep changes. But for me, it didn't show me the option the option to keep changes that's why i couldn't keep changes you know really? but we're gonna try three two one go mm. okay so i have i'm surprised it's working actually i'm surprised hdmi i'm on 240 hertz on hdmi Okay. 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 It, it, oh, uh. <laughs> so guys, I just got into the game right now. What's the max FPS I can actually get with this? I can't even get close to 300. There's no... It doesn't feel different. Damn. I'm getting a lot of FPS for a screen here.
Damn. To be honest with you guys, I don't think it's the actual HDMI that's working because as soon as I plug out the HDMI, the display port, like I showed you guys, I have the display port and the HDMI plugged in at the same time. So as soon as I take out the, uh, the display port, like my screen just goes black. And when I try to plug the HDMI by itself, it's not working. I think I messed up a setting there, but I still wouldn't recommend HDMI. But if it's the only option, just go for the HDMI 2.1. Don't get the HDMI uh, 2 or the HDMI. Just go for the HDMI 2.1 and make sure to ask the manufacturer if it's like if you're able to get 240 hertz. But yeah, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope this video helped y'all.